Public Authority for Radio and Television won the Best Media Initiative. The winning entrepreneurs and SMEs as well as supporters of the entrepreneurship were honored during the event. Within the efforts made to achieve the strategic aims of the world and promote the development of SMEs, the award joined the European Foundation for Quality Management to ensure implementing the best international practices to ensure added value by improving the assessment and selection through training workshop for evaluators. The Royal Air Force of, of Oman celebrated the graduation of a new batch of air and pilot officers of the military parade ground at Ala Air Base and the Sultan Qaboos Air Academy. The ceremony was presided over by His Excellency Sayyid Lieutenant General Mandir bin Majid Al Said, Head of Liaison and Coordination of the Royal Office. Now we move to the international news. <laughs> celebration of the founding of Old Kingdom, saying they were not informed about it beforehand. Meanwhile, UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres expressed concerns after Myanmar and Bangladesh reached a deal on the return of hundreds of thousands of Muslim Rohingyas that sidelined the UN Refugee Agency. Guterres said it will be very important to have the UN Refugee Agency fully involved in the operation to guarantee that the operation abides by international standards. The agreement finalized in Myanmar's capital this week sets a two-year deadline for the repatriation of the Rohingya. Join the news at the main points once again. The Public Authority for Radio and Television wins the Best Media Initiative. The Royal Air Force of Oman celebrates the graduation of a new batch of air and pilot officers. The Syrian government's military media releases a video purporting to show fighting between the Syrian army and a rebel group in southern Aleppo. And British MPs will vote today on a key Brexit bill. Dear listeners, this news is read to you by Ilham Al Belushi, edited by Noor Al Mahmari, and from here directed by Ahmad Bani Araba. Thank you for listening. Spatial Strategy Project, the Supreme Council for Planning is preparing a national transport survey to make the highway network and transport systems work better for you. You may be approached at home or during your trips by a survey interviewer. Please cooperate by answering some simple questions to help meet your transport needs and improve.